SEPTA will begin offering extra Broad Street Line and regional rail service for WrestleMania events starting on Thursday. Our Josh Sanders took a ride with SEPTA officers to see their safety plan for the 200,000 fans expected to visit Philadelphia. Apologize for the Yankees hat. Oh, so pumped. Uh, one of the biggest WrestleManias ever, and of course, it's in one of the best cities on planet Earth. Came down here to check out all the banners they have hung up. It's awesome. Sean O'Neill has been a fan of WrestleMania for as long as he can remember. I actually met The Rock when Franklin Mills Mall had him over there. So I still have a picture of me and The Rock when I was younger. So it's kind of crazy to think like how much bigger he's gotten since then. And he's going to be down at the link this weekend. O'Neill is one of hundreds of thousands of riders who use SEPTA on any given week. Later this week, city officials are expecting many, many more to use the Broad Street line on their way to the link. We're looking forward to the over 100,000 of people that are expected to come for the WWE this uh, next five days. And um, to prepare for that, we have increased patrols everywhere from Jefferson Station down to the NRG stadiums. SEPTA Police Captain R. Kit Walls says they typically deploy 80 officers for weekend services, but now we'll be adding 30% more patrols for WrestleMania 40 events across the city. Knowing how SEPTA has been over the last couple of years, uh, definitely a lot of comfort in hearing that they're going to make more of an effort with the increased population this upcoming weekend. SEPTA will also deploy 100 employee volunteer ambassadors at Jefferson and NRG stations, working alongside SEPTA outreach services, helping fans maneuver around the city. Virtual patrol of the station. Along with the extra manpower, the department's virtual patrol unit has access to 30,000 cameras, monitoring any criminal activity involving the country's sixth largest transportation system. SEPTA officials tell us they will begin those additional services this Friday for WWE SmackDown at Wells Fargo. We have that information on our website at cbsphiladelphia.com. Josh Sanders, CBS News, Philadelphia. Well, there is a lot going on in the city this week. You can find our full coverage on WrestleMania right now on cbsphiladelphia.com.